friends welcome to my channel here we are going to solve a new problem that is the perimeter of a rectangle is 13 cm and its width is 2 3 by 4 cm we have to find the length of this rectangle so they have given the perimeter of the rectangle and they have given the width that is breadth of the rectangle so let us start, solve it so let us write the given values first given breadth or the width of rectangle the list 2 3 by 4 centimeters through 3 by 4 it is in mixed fraction form so from mixed fraction we can change it in into improper fraction right so by how by multiplying the denominator with the whole and adding this um, product with the numerator so let's check I'll tell you into plus. So first you have to multiply this denominator with the whole. That will become 8. 8 plus 3 we get 11. So it will be 11 by 4 centimeters in improper fraction. This is improper fraction. So this is the breadth of the rectangle. Now perimeter. Perimeter of rectangle is. Of this rectangle is. 13 centimeters. This 13 centimeters can be equated with the formula that is 2 into L plus B, right? With this formula only we will be finding this rectangle perimeter. They have given this perimeter and they have given the breadth. So they are asking us to find this length. So with this formula only we can find the length. So let us start equating it. That is 2 into L plus B, the perimeter is equals to 13. In place of B, let us substitute the value of 11 by 4 centimeters. Let us do it in next page. We have got it like 2 into L plus B equal to 13 centimeters. 2 into L plus we have to find the value of L and B value we know that is 11 by 4. That is equal to 13 centimeters. Now, this length value, we will take it as L itself and let us multiply this 2 inside the brackets. So, that will be 2L plus 11 by 4 into 2 that is equals to 13 centimeters. That will be 2L plus 11 by 2. 2 ones, 2 twos. So, 11 by 2 that will be 13 centimeters. And then here next step we can do is let us bring this 11 by 2 to the RHS. All constants should be in one side. So let us bring this 11 by 2 to RHS. From LHS from LHS plus 11 by 2 when it goes to RHS it will become minus 11 by 2. So 2L will be equal to 13 minus 11 by 2. Now let us solve it. Two L is equals to thirteen minus eleven by two. Now we can simplify the uh, multi, uh, simplify it like two L will be equal to twenty six minus eleven by two. How? Because when we take LCM for thirteen, uh, thirteen can be multiplied with the two on numerator and denom uh, denominator on two to make the denominators equal. So it will be twenty six by two then. So 2L will be 26 by uh, minus 11 by 2. If we simplify this on RHS, that will become 15 by 2. And we have to find the value of L. So let us bring this 2, which is a numerator in LHS, to the denominator in RHS. So it will become the denominator in the RHS when we move it to LHS from RHS. Now, if it is to, uh, 15 by 2 by 2. So let us take the reciprocal of 2 to make our simplification easier. So L will, e will be equal to 15 by 2 into 1 by 2. If there is no denominator that means the denominator is 1. So 2 by 1 if you take a reciprocal it will be 1 by 2. So like that we have taken the reciprocal and from here. L value will be equal to 15 by 2 into 1 by 2 which will be equal to 
if we multiply two fractions that is 15 into 1 we get 15 and 2 into 2 we get 4 so l value is equals to 15 by 4 let us keep this in proper fraction into mixed fraction so at this situation what can we do we have to divide this 4 this is 15 with 4 let us do the division if uh, 4 3s are 12 and you get 3 as denominator so what do you get here is l is equal to 3 3 by 4 first we have to write the quotient this is quotient this is reminder right this quotient as a will be the whole form and this reminder will be the numerator and this um, div, uh, divisor will be the denominator so l value will be 3 3 by 4 centimeters so we have found the length of the rectangle that's it if you like my video please like share and subscribe Thank you.